science project. First I needed a motor, so I went to our messy garage, grabbed an old printer out of a box. Got some cardboard, some styrofoam, and some random stuff from here in the garage. This began by pulling the old printer apart for the little motor. Old printer that would otherwise get thrown away. Also grabbed some speakers. Maybe use that LED right on the front there, so we'll see. So I got the shell off the printer. This is the part I need. The little motor right here. So not sure if the motor from the printer will work. It seems that it has kind of a notchy like spin and it doesn't spin that well. So I'm gonna try maybe a hair dryer and check it out here. Now for the fan blades, I use the Safeway milk carton. Also use the lid for the little center spinny thing. And uh, cut out some strips and semi looking figures like that. You then take these strips here and you hot glue little wood skewers that I found in the kitchen to the back for support because it's kind of flimsy the milk carton isn't that strong. You take the top of the milk jug right here and you paste, you glue glue the little um, wind turbine blades which are semi-rounded as you can see catch the wind glue them to the piece that will initially spin so now this is what the thing looks like with the glued blades as you can see And uh, what I did now is I got some metal ball bear uh, bearings from my old skateboard here. I took one of the spacers and I put it on the back, hot glued. Now we'll go and we'll be cutting out the body that'll look something like this. I'm going to do two of them just for extra strength here. New fan model here, a little bit thinner, sleeker in design, a little bit of hot glue, new motor, good stuff with my LED right there. So as you can see, it's the finished product. 